group that has been punishing, grinding, and filled with L's comes to an end tonight, and can they turn that around with a W? Let's find out. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. The Flyers take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Goes right to the crease! He scores! That's 30 of the year! Now you're getting into the big numbers. You get a 30 and beyond. That's a great year. He's known around the league for this. I mean, he gets a little bit of room. He's so accurate. As soon as he can settle that puck down, he can deliver the puck exactly where he wants it to go. The Penguins have turned it up to 11 here early with that goal. They told us this morning that they wanted to attack early. They thought that the other team might not be ready for a quick start. Turns out they were right. Moves it quickly over to Couturier. Pittsburgh's got the puck. Can't make it work. And there's the whistle icing the call. Ellis was talking about his missed chances earlier today. It all adds up to a pointless streak that he can't seem to break. Victoria is depended upon greatly by his teammates. He's one of the stars of this team and needs to produce night in and night out. Crosby's known for scoring with his beauty backhand zone ability because it's hard for goalies to read. Look to one of these players to be a difference maker in this one. Back up to the booth. And now it's grabbed by Dumoulin. From the point, looks to make something happen. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Quick shot! Great save! Played it perfect! And a good solid hit on that play. Pittsburgh's got the puck inside the defensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here's a short pass to Zucker. Shot! Quick stop by Hart. And that slides right out to center ice. The Penguins will play it in their own end. Moves it to Pedersen. Taken by Zucker. Makes the save with the trapper. Hart's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Still lots of time left in the period. Pittsburgh's ahead 1-0. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Pedersen. Scooped up along the wall by Carter. Hammers a shot. Shuts the door with a great save. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. And offside will get a reset here. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Penguins lead it 1-0. Carter's one possession. Moves the puck along the half wall. Picked up along the boards by Benito. Puck scooped up by Granlin. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Cuts to the front. What a steal in his own end. The Flyers have checked really well here. This is a tight game, and they're looking to generate some offense off a turnover. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Philadelphia's got the puck here in the open ice. Quick feed to Atkinson. And a great read to turn that play aside. Here's a chance. Stops that one. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. Gains the zone. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. Here in the late going of the frame, we got a 1-0 game to this point. Lund's won the draw here in the neutral zone. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Directed over to Heinen. Puck picked up by Lawton. And he takes the dish. The Penguins gain possession in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Tippett. Slides the puck ahead to Ruda. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Archibald. And the puck skips away after that move. 
And now he tries to get it across to Archibald. That concludes period number one. I cannot believe they got one of the all-time great 90s hip-hop acts getting set to play for the fans here in this intermission. I can't wait for this. We'll come back in period number two in just a bit. Hey, fans, be sure to get your season tickets now at this year's playoff locations in Portland. Both teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Stavalski ready to bring in the call for period number two. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. And with play underway, Razor, how do you see things so far tonight? Philadelphia is looking to overcome that slow start. They just didn't have it early. And by the time their legs started to come around, they were chasing the game. The second period gives them a new opportunity. Feeds the puck over to Ellis. Great puck check on the reach. Here's the chance in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Taken along the wall by Konechny. Puck grab by Raquel. Centering feed. It scores! What an opportunity and delivers! When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Pittsburgh's now made their way back to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, Ray? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Don't back up. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, how did that stay out? What a toe stop on the play. Race! Feels really good. He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time. And that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Penguins now lead it 3-0 here as they get back to center. This game's in danger of being a rout, James. They've had the puck most of the time, and now they're up a field goal. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Here's a short pass to Malkin. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Takes it to the front. Picked up along the wall by Malkin. Here's a chance. Oh, how did he get a piece of that to make the save? Hart's played poorly. The forwards and defensemen have played poorly. You can wrap a bowl around this one, James, and package it up. That's a bad night. Sends it in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Grabbed along the board by Kulikov. Passes it over to Zucker. Takes the feed. And that's blocked in traffic. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Lawton's going to play it against the half wall. Hammers one at the net. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. That's a solid check on the play. Scooped up along the wall by Kulikov. And now he angles it across to Zucker. Slides the puck down low. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. Cutting to the slot. The Penguins take possession in the defensive end. Takes it and looks ahead. Good stand-up hit on the play. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Here they come on the attack down the right side. And they get the extra attacker out as the goaltender gets to the bench. Granlin's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. And a solid save on the play there. Let's get the official decision. One's bad, two's worse. I, I think they got two here, James. Two penalties called on this play. unit and they've got lots of time with this five on three it's a long five on three you better get on the right page to take advantage of all this extra space too many times the power play just sits on the outside pittsburgh's got it from behind the net slides the puck over to gensel he's got two another one would be pretty sweet 
second period, Ray. I'll tell you what those two locker rooms are going to be like, James. I've been in both of them. The one that's way ahead, it is a giggle fest. Everyone's having a good time. The other one, you can hear a pin drop from anywhere in that room. I'll take the giggles. Pittsburgh sliding the puck behind the net. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Can't make the connection on the pass. Hammers the shot. so this guy's going to have to stay in there. The relief goaltender doesn't make the stop. He's fishing it out of his net, too. The Penguins are putting on an impressive offensive display tonight here late in this second period. What's always funny to me about this is you talk to the coaches before the game, and they tell you, oh, I'm not so sure about our team. And then they come out and play like this. Takes it into the slot. Decides to think about it. Pittsburgh's got him along the wall. Looks to set up at the point now. Well, this has been a fun one here tonight. Great energy here in the building as well. We'll get a fresh sheet of ice and come back with period number three in moments. this thing the flyers have been frenetic all game long like they don't have the puck they don't keep it everything is a little bit scrambly for them so far if they can hold on to it a bit here in the third maybe you can get into the game feeds the puck across to connect me here we go pucks in deep pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall the penguins are in transition from point blank range. Poked away in the neutral zone by Jubilee. Centering feed. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. And that doesn't reach the net. Solid hit on the play. Wicked stop by the goaltender. Now, this is a good save here, James. I mean, he's got to read the play to get into position to make this stop. A difficult one from the slot. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves it to Latang. Quick pass to Rust. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by D'Angelo. And now he moves it to Pedersen. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Works it across to Sanheim. The Flyers played along the boards. Shot right in front! And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Perfect timing to get on the board. Man, they would have liked this a long time ago, James. They've been working away trying to punch through. They finally get one by the goaltender. The Flyers still have a lot of catching up to do, but they have something to build on now. Yeah, they do, and I think what they can look forward to is the buzzer is closer to the oh, end of the game. Oh, you went there, huh? Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Here's a pass in front! Oh, he comes up with a stop. Slides the puck across to Benino. And now it's grabbed by Carter. Quick pass to Benino. Here they come on the attack. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Oh, 
just puts it wide of the net. Uh, trying to be a little fine with it. This is a good goaltender. You know you have to make a really great shot to beat him. But he just fires it wide. Dumps it in. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. The Golden Knights are on the save the date calendar next for these guys. Yeah, fans of both teams will really look forward to that matchup. It's generally a pretty aggressive game. Never an off night in this league. Heinen's won the draw, and they'll look to set up. Picked up along the boards by Archibald. Handles the puck at the point. Quick feed to Paling. The Penguins carry it along the wall. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. The Flyers have it against the wall. Grabbed along the board by Tippett. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. To his teammate, and he comes up with it. Slides it across to Frost. Moves it quickly over to York. And mercifully down to seconds left in this one. Steps across the blue line. The Flyers have it behind the cage. Poked away at center by Joseph. Good fight for the puck along the boards. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. And now it's over to Frost. The Penguins look to start the transition game. Quick pass across to Raquel. Ellis takes the puck. Here's a short pass to Frost. Great use of the stick here at center ice. And the crowd's on their feet, saluting the team after a hard-fought effort this evening. Sends it over to Frost. Coughs it up in the neutral zone. And there it is! Getzel's team gets the win, and a big part of that is hat-trick performance. He's so good when he gets the puck on his stick. He's got a real sense of when to deliver it, and he was lights out tonight. Kids love this part here, don't they? They're gonna love this too because the players, they, everything slowed down. They come to center ice and salute the fans. They feel part of it. Well, this one's in the books. A fun one tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good night.